Russia's back with a vengeance and Vladimir Putin isn't holding back. The prime minister saying the U.S. is a, quote, parasite on the global economy and a threat to world financial markets. Are the U.S.-Russian relations on a slippery slope? Heritage Foundation Senior Fellow for Russian Studies, Ariel Cohen, joins us now. Sir, what's with the renewed, I don't know, stepped-up rhetoric out of, out of Putin lately? Well, Vladimir Putin uh, has a default mode, and that is hit America. Uh, he does like the United States. He's campaigning to get back in power in 2012 to be uh, the president of Russia for the third time. Uh, and he is really upset because for a moment it looked like we may default and Russia, and he mentioned also China, uh, are holding a lot of their reserves in U.S. Treasuries. So for the Russians, with their memory of a horrible Russian default, when they devalue their currency 75% in 1998, a default means an economic catastrophe. And as they're holding billions and billions uh, uh, of U.S. Okay, treasuries. Okay, okay, hold on, let me stop you yeah. here. So why is this genius talking us down? Why is he saying, hey, America, you're a parasite. If he's worried about the default, he should be building us up, should he not? No, uh, not Vlad Putin, uh, especially when he's talking to a younger audience. He is trying to communicate his anti-American sentiment. Remember, it was the Soviet Union who lost the Cold War. There's a lot of residual resentment in Russia about that. Yeah, but, and but, but, Mr. Sir, but sir, Ariel, yeah, listen, I follow this quite a bit. I'm an oil trader for 23 years. I know exactly what this is all about. This is Putin who wants okay. to get back in power. He should be thanking his lucky, I don't know, Vladimir, the terrible stars that were even around, that we won the Cold War, tore it on the wall, got uh, rid of communism and capitalism, where this guy can become a billionaire and a three-time dictator of, of Russia. Absolutely not. Uh, Vladimir Putin is always looking at the world through a prism uh, of the competition with the United States. He wants as big and as powerful as we are, um, and he's kicking us uh, when uh, our economy is down. He said, look at them. Uh, they're irresponsible. They led their debt uh, to become a, a runaway problem for the world. Uh, and not just Vladimir Putin, even our friend uh, Nicolas Sarkozy, uh, the president of France, is mouthing uh, the same bromides about a dollar not being, uh, right. or the dollar right. should not be the only We, we hear that from currency. time to time. I agree with you, but no one listens to Sarkozy anyway. Uh, and by the way, Medvedev, <laughs> who's the, the prime minister of Russia right now, will certainly step aside and let Mr. Putin, right, well, he'll let Mr. Putin step in because that Med, Putin put Medvedev in. Absolutely. Uh, Medvedev is the sorcerer's apprentice. Uh, he was Putin's legal advisor and consigliere, and now that the requirement of the Russian constitution is fulfilled, Putin can come back and Medvedev would just uh, salute and do what the boss says. Absolutely. Absolutely agree, Sarah. Thank you very much for joining us, Ariel Cohen. Pleasure.